All right, in this question, we're given uh, a height equation uh, where t represents the time after a ball was kicked and h, or h of t, represents the height. We're asked to find the highest point. Graphically, uh, what this would look like is something like this. We would be a quadratic. We know it's downward facing or concave down because of the negative a coefficient or negative 16. Again, we have time along this axis and height along this axis. What we're trying to solve for is this peak point right here, uh, which is always at the vertex. Okay, so we, since we have uh, a quadratic in standard form, we're going to use the quadratic equation, or sorry, the quadratic formula for vertex um, to solve this. In this case, the vertex occurs at negative b over 2a. And in this example, uh, b is 64. So we have negative 64 over 2 times negative 16. This ends up being negative 64 over negative 32, which is 2. So this gives us uh, the time value, the input value of the height of the ball. So it tells us when it happens. In this case, time was seconds, so it's after two seconds. To find the actual height, well, we just got to plug in 2 to the original function and evaluate it. If I did my math right, I got 71 from this. And again, what that tells us is this height was 71 after two seconds. We found two seconds using the vertex formula for a quadratic in the standard form here. You plug that two seconds back in to find out what the height was at that point. And there we have the answer to our question. After two seconds, it reached a maximum height of 71 feet.